hey everyone welcome back to the channel today we are going to build an ai powered chatbot in python using natural language processing by the end of this tutorial you will have a chatbot that can recognize greetings farewells and common questions it uses a natural language toolkit for text processing respond intelligently based on predefined patterns learn the basics of stemming and tokenization this is a perfect beginner friendly project that introduces you to natural language processing and chatbot development so let's get started so first we need to understand the project how will our chatbot work the chatbot will take user input process it using natural language processing and match it with predefined responses it will use tokenization and stemming to understand user messages better we will define different categories of intents like greetings farewells small talk and map them to appropriate responses if the chatbot doesn't recognize a message it will provide a default response so what kind of technology we used for this project so as we know we use python natural language toolkit for text processing random module for generating varied responses now let's start coding so first uh, importing the necessary libraries the first one is uh, import random the second one is uh, import nltk if uh, you don't have the nltk then open the terminal and install write the command pip install nltk now after this uh, from nltk dot stem import porter stemmer okay now the last one is uh, i already prepared the data for the project in a separate file so you need to place chatbot.py and data.py in a folder and the folder name it's up to you now here i am import data so from data import data okay so random select responses from predefined lists and the nltk toolkit which helps process text the porter stemmer reduce words to their root from form uh, for example running so it will convert it into run clapping so it, it uh, will convert it into clap now data dot pi a separate file that contains predefined chatbot responses okay now before running the script make sure you have nltk installed so i already write the command here to install the nltk okay to process text efficiently we need to download some nltk resources so i use the comment nltk and download required resources okay now nltk dot download unkt and the second one is i miss the inverted commas okay dot download inverted commas kt underscore tab now after this uh, stemmer equal to porter stemmer so PUNKT help in tokenizing words splitting sentences into words porter stemmer convert words to their root form helping the chatbot understand user input better now after this uh, let's map different type of user inputs intent to predefined responses so map uh, intent categories to their corresponding response categories so intent underscore response underscore map so equal to 
parenthesis so greetings response comma now the second one is uh, farewells after this uh, farewell response okay now the third one is questions responses now the last one is uh, small talk small talk responses so where it will get these values these categories so these are in the data.py file so here greetings response farewells farewell responses and so on so this dictionary connects user intent types greeting question etc with predefined responsible list stored in data.py so if a user greets the bot picks a response from responses in the data.py next we define the pre-processing function to clean and standardize user input so define a function named pre-process so it will get the argument which is sentence so tokens equal to nltk dot word underscore tokenize sentence dot lower ce okay now after this uh, return stemmer dot stem token for token in tokens so tokenization splits user input into words it to convert text to lowercase for consistency and the last one stemming converts word to their base form like playing so convert it into play so why okay token why it will show error here t u r n okay now we implement the chatbot's logic to match user input with predefined responses so again uh, create uh, the function get response so it will get the argument user input now after this uh, processed input equal to preprocess user underscore input now check for all the pattern categories so for intent underscore category comma response underscore category in intent underscore response map dot items okay so again use the for loop pattern in data intent underscore category after this uh, processed pattern equal to preprocess pattern now use the if condition if all word in processed underscore input forward in processed pattern now return random dot choice data response underscore category okay now after this uh, fallback for unknown inputs 
so return I'm not sure how to respond to that could you rephrase that so pre-process with the input argument so it will clean and pre-process user input now after this uh, intent uh, matching so loop through predefined patterns and check if they match the user input now after this uh, random response pick a random response from the matching category now after this see the fallback message if not match is found it return a default response now finally let's create a function to start the chatbot so for this uh, here we use the define chat so print chatbot hello I am your friendly chatbot type exit to end the conversation ok so while true user input equal to input u dot uh, strip ok now after this if uh, user underscore input dot lower equal to exit then print chatbot goodbye have a great day now after this uh, break now response equal to get underscore response user underscore input print formatted string chatbot response so the chatbot runs in the loop taking user input when write the exact exact by user so the chatbot ends the conversation and after the response generation calls get response function so and print the bot reply now the final step is to execute the chatbot so write uh, this line at the bottom of the script equal to and call the function chat now save ok now the script is running with the AI powered bot so let's check its responses I write uh, hello again I say hi so the next response is nice to see you ok so check for the now I am writing here how are you so its response is I was created by a developer so congratulations you have successfully built a smart chatbot in python using natural language processing so in this video you learned how to tokenize and pre-process text using NLTK use stemming to improve text matching map user intents to predefined responses handle unknown user inputs gracefully so if you want to talk this chatbot further try adding machine learning models or integrating with the flask web app let me know in the comments what's the first question you asked your chatbot so don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more Python projects.